Hey, you, what is up, everyone? This is Dark Sage 101, and welcome back to Pokemon Light Platinum Rebirth. Our uh, last episode, we went through uh, Mount Ziri, and uh, it took me uh, not that not that long, actually. It actually wasn't as long as I, was, uh, as I thought it was. It's actually the next cave that's really long. It's, uh, I think it's actually called uh, Mount Winter, uh, which is kind of an interesting name. So, yeah. Um... And then we just kind of just made it to this town, and then we ended off after, like, talking to a couple NPCs, so, yeah. Uh, we also caught a Joltik in the last episode, which I actually did train up, as you can see, I got him, or got her all the way up to 31, uh, which is not as much as I well, wanted to level this thing up, because it, it's taking forever, and uh, not only that, I have to use an experience share, because this thing is so weak, so, yeah. But, yeah, as you can see, well, next is still 38, and then everyone else is basically the same level, except, like, I don't know, maybe, like, a level here and there, uh, because of terrible, but, yeah. So, yeah, in this episode today, we're gonna be doing the, uh, the next gym, and to keep this one, uh, a little bit shorter. <sighs> we'll talk to all the NPCs, and then we'll do the gym, so, yeah. So, Ridley City is known as Zuri's City of Light because of its illustrious lights in the region. By the way, the uh, the gym is electric type. I don't know if I've talked to these people. I'd like to train my Pokemon until as strong as possible. Would you like to train Pokemon with me? I'm looking for a sand troop for my Graveler. And that's how you get a Golem. Dad works at the power plant. Nice. Let's speed this up. We are flying and water Pokemon are weak against the electric type. Oh yeah, there. Just over there you can see the power plant, which can be quite dangerous. Uh, I got quite a bit of money. Nah, I'll still save. I'll still save that. I don't need to use it right now. Uh, okay, that's the same dialogue. This is the power plant, which we will go in in a bit. We've been working on this Serenity City power plant for a long time. We generate power for the most of the region. Just over there, you can see the power plant. Okay, that's the same dialogue. Okay, same dialogue. Check over here. The mood leader. Um, okay, I don't need you yet. Okay, that's the same dialogue. Alright, same dialogue. The Liddy. Li <laughs> The leader of our gym is Rainer. He fights offensively, so be be careful. Yep, type electric. Hey, the door is locked. Same dialogue. Up ahead is the take care center. If you leave your Pokemon there long enough, they may lay eggs. Yep. I believe this is closed. No, it isn't. I don't think there's any... No, there's no trainers in here. Um, and actually the gym leader is in the power plant. Let me just hope that this game doesn't bug out on me. Because I remember the game bugging out right there. Okay, I'll go. Actually, we'll, we'll, we'll level the Pokemon over here. Oh, jeez. Okay, that would have been so much easier to level grind. That's fine. That is fine. One of these NPCs are just getting in my way. We're working on the new new technology to make the equipment in the power plant even more efficient. Welcome to Sruti City's power plant, where, we, where kinetic energy is transformed into electricity and sent over to Ziri. And this is probably the same dialogue. Yep. I'm visiting the power plant to see all the new technology. Okay, that is the same dialogue. Also same dialogue. I don't believe there's anything hidden over here. Yeah, there's nothing hidden. Okay, fair enough. Oh, yeah. I'll show you the power plant strength in battle. In battle. That was a cool scientist sprite. We'll do this. Her ugly. Actually, yeah, this is fine. Uh, let's just do a lava surf. Yeah, there we go. 
It's important that we always work closely with our Pokemon. Okay, that's just like that. Like, I'm improving these electric towers to, or these energy towers to increase our efficiency. 25, thank you. I believe that's Thunderbolt right there. Or th a Thunder. Oh yeah, by the way, I did get Thunderbolt on uh, Turret Bolt. Yeah, she learned it, I think, at like 30 or something like that. She learned it like really early. I've been training here for a while. Nice. Today our power plant is one of the most advanced in the world because we work on it every day. Okay, the gym leader's not there, so we're gonna have to reload the area. Oh my gosh, I hate the bugs in this game. That's a game that's a that actually can be a game breaking bug. Improve this improving this machinery is my job, but I want a battle. Mmm, strength, yeah. Yeah, that was fine. That was the same dialogue. Uh, okay, or you just... He just popped out of thin air right there. Alright, whatever. It's ready at last. Now we can reconnect the turbines and the power will turn on. Finally, the power is back on and I'll return my gym. Hey, you okay? I was just working to restore the power in the power plant. I'm Rainer, the, the gym leader of Serenity City. Now the power's back on, I'll return to my gym. He's an elected by the way. So yeah, he's gonna be a, a kind of a meat grinder. Electivire is an insanely, insanely good Pokemon. Okay, so now we can battle him. I'm gonna quickly heal and battle him. I guess we'll do a little more. I don't need to end it like just after we beat him. Unless he takes literally ages. Okay, yeah, we don't have any ground type moves. Uh, I guess Xena and Popeye is just probably good enough. Let's just do this. Welcome to Sony City Gym. The leader Rainer uses electric type Pokemon. Hint, use ground attacks. Yep. We're gonna do the electricity is dangerous. Our leader Rainer will defeat any challengers. Ooh, decent money right there. Almost 2,500. Heck yeah, dude. Okay, not that one. Yep. I can feel the electricity running through my brain and through my veins. Oh, nice. Oh, jeez, not yet for us. Okay, we're good. Uh, do this, this. Gosh, stupid paralysis. Do this. Come on. Come on. Okay, there we go. That was lucky. Uh, Turbo, uh, the single beam? Uh, I'm not complaining too much. I'll take it. Legend attacks have a chance to of leaving the opponent paralyzed. Which unfortunately you didn't do. I actually made myself paralyzed because I attacked an electric type mode when I gosh darn hate static. <sighs> that is definitely my top ten like most annoying abilities to deal with. Cause almost every electric type Pokemon can like have that ability. So darn annoying. I'm ready to face any challenger. Nice. Uh, let's just do a strength. Okay, we're good. Uh, ice match. Yeah. Rainer is very skilled at using electric type electric attacks. It's impossible for you to win. It's quote unquote impossible. Today you will learn the strength of electric currents. Rainer fights with two, uh, 220 volts. 
Okay, let's quickly heal and then we will battle Raider. Hopefully he puts up a pretty decent fight. So far the hardest gym leader was the water one. Most of the gym leaders actually have been pretty easy, so... The gym leaders in this game aren't really too difficult. Actually, the game really isn't that hard. It's just the money gain is awful. I'd say the only like hard part is the darn Elite Four. Well, because it's... They have super inflated levels. Like, the game goes from, like manageable levels like 50s to like 70s like immediately yes the elite four is like almost a level 80 elite four i'm not ready for that keep on that's halfway through the game there's two regions in this game so we're gonna be fighting hundred level hundreds later on lovely i'm ready to face any challenge that's the same dialogue okay we're good we're good we're still good Yep, we're still good. Okay, that's Rainer. Okay, let's go ahead and speed out of here, heal, and then we'll we'll do it. I didn't know there was another trainer. I gotta edit a video after this too. That's part, that's partially why I'm making this shorter because I need to have as much time as possible to edit that edit that video. Um, what you've been wondering is Andron Saga. That's why there's no Andron Saga today. Otherwise, they would uh, there would be. Although I kind of do need to take a break from it because oh my gosh, it is irritating the crap out of me. It is pretty darn fun though. Ultimate, yeah, that game is really good. <clears throat> Welcome to Ceridi City Gym, the gym of the City of Light. This gym specializes in electricity. As its leader, I'll battle you. And you look like Vulcaner. Okay, uh, do this. Yeah, we'll do this. Okay, yeah, your ultimate. Oh, wow, one shot. Uh, Minec Trick will do this. Go back to Popeyes. Okay, that was absolutely pathetic. <laughs> I, I might be just way too strong for this guy, but anyways, whatever. That was easy. Easy as pie. Dude, that was easier probably than the first gym leader. You've proven yourself to have great power. Enough to learn the master of electricity. Almost 2,000. I guess I'll take it. And there's our Galvantula. Awesome. Terra Volt's probably still going to be a little too weak right now, but uh, at least until I get this thing to like 40, but at least I'll be able to level grind with it. Galvantula is amazing, by the way. Congratulations, you've beaten me... Beating, beating me honorably. For a second, I thought that said, Congratulations, you've beaten me horribly. <laughs> I did beat you pretty horribly, not gonna lie. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> oh, man. By doing so, you've earned the energy badge. Congratulations, you've beaten me horribly. <laughs> oh, man. With the energy badge, you can use HMO2 fly outside of battle. I don't even have that. The fly in to and from any city you have already vis visited. I have another gift. Okay, that should be Thunderbolt right there. Yeah. It's one of the best electric type of attacks. Is it combines power and accuracy. Yep. It's very good. Look at our team after that crap, by the way. Barely hurt. <laughs> but paralyzed and Popeye's got just a about a third taken off. DHK. Just easy peasy, dude. Oh, well, I did one shot like half his team, so. I one shot at his ultimate, his uh, Electifier. I one shot at that. That was, I think, just with a Lava Surf. Blaze of is pretty awesome. Let's check out Gavantula, anyways. Oh, yeah, you have Volt Absorb. Nice. So you're gonna be extra good for Electro types. 
Oh, oh my gosh, so high speed. Level 36 and has over 100 speed. Yeah, you can already tell that this thing is going to be a meat grinder. It's the definition of a glass cannon. Like, as you can see, terrible defense stats, but, like, look at the attack on this guy. Keep on, this is level 36. Imagine this guy, like, at team level. Yeah, you're going to be awesome. I'm still going to keep that, like, uh, experience share on him, though, because... Very, very underleveled, because we're fighting like almost level 50 Pokemon, and he's not even 40, or she's not even 40. Actually, I do have Surf, so I can actually check this. I don't think this. Yeah, that's nothing. Let's check over here really quick. We got a couple more trainers. Um, we'll do Popeyes, I guess. I've been looking for a battle all day. Let's have some fun. Oh, jeez. Yeah, we're good. Lava Surf is just straight up overpowered. Uh, mirror move, nah. What come on should be treated with respect because some of them only evolve when they're happy? Yup. In order to get eggs from the daycare center, you should leave two Pokemon of different genders, male and female. Cool. A light ball, that's useless. Oops. Uh, Marie. That was a cool Marie sprite. Wait, you don't battle? You know that's my dog. To, act, to, yeah. to hatch an egg, you must put it on your team and walk around with it. Every step you take brings it closer to birth. Yep. Although, literally, hatching eggs is like the easiest thing ever on an emulator like this, because I can literally just do this. <laughs> like, I literally can just walk back and forth with a Team Steam uniform or something, and it literally it takes me like a minute. It's so easy. I left a leader, ugh, Nidoran male and Nidoran female at the daycare center and got a beautiful Nidoran egg. Nice. I've been watching you. I think you'll be a good opponent. You've been watching me. How dare you. It's not always the best trainer that wins. But we both gain experience from battles. We both get experience from battles. Didn't even get an attack off. Yep, that is same dialogue. Let's see who knows more about battling. But obviously me. True fact, I've been playing Pokemon for almost 14 years now. Almost! Almost 14! <laughs> I've been playing Pokemon for ages. My Pokemon are getting stronger in the daycare center so they... So they can lay eggs. It's cool. Yeah, I've been playing Pokemon for almost 14 years. That honestly is ridiculous. If you're wondering, yes, my first my first Pokemon game was uh, Pokemon Soul Silver. Yeah, I started with a Gen Gen 2 remake, and then my next Pokemon game was um, Pokemon Diamond, and then it was Oris. So yeah, I got Mega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire on the 3DS, and then after that was Pokemon Sun, and then uh, Pokemon X and Y. So yeah, if you want to get rid of those annoying bushes, just use Cut. I don't care for you. A nest ball. Drake Breast City. This is a dead end. Ha! Finally someone to fight. We'll finish this route. Wow, okay. I, I must have missed or something. That was a low punny. Uh, yeah, this is fine. Place kick. Yeah. Beautify. Yeah, this is fine. Today you've beaten me, but sooner or later I'll be stronger than you. Draco City is a little further down this route. Contains the last gem. Yep. The last gem. Yes, you guessed it. It's, uh, it's Dragon. It's pretty obvious, though. Yeah, it's Dragon. It's actually a pretty hard gem. 
yeah, it's pretty difficult, but at the same time, you get so many Pokemon, like, before it, so you're, you should be fine, you, you, I mean, there's, you can get a nice type before it, so you're kind of fine. What is, I thought that was a K for a second there. Finally, another trainer. Do this. That was a Pidgeotto or something like that. We'll just do a uh, Terra. Thunderbolt. You know, wait. You know why the trainer who only wears red? You find this. You fight the same way. Who only wears red? Well, that's why his name is Red. His name is Red because he wears red. The more you know. This looks like a good place to fish. It does, actually. I'm a Spelunker. If you want to get through Mouse, Mount Ice Storm, bring a Fire Pokemon to help you. I got a really good Fire type to go through there. Come grant me the gift of victory. Gift of victory. Unfortunately, you're not going to have that. Easy battle. I need to go to the Pokemon Center. Yeah, you do. Today I'll train here. It's nice and quiet. Ultra Ball. Hi, Sunker. Get ready for the best cheerleader in Ziri. Oh, by the way, speaking of uh, Sunkern, if you're wondering, uh, have I used Sunflora? I have. I've used it. I've used it before. Actually, is kind of a little underrated, but I could definitely see it not. I can definitely see people not using it though. But I, I actually consider it kind of underrated. It's got, you know, good special attack, good. Uh, a pretty decent move set, yeah. A pretty decent move, uh, move variety and stuff. It, it can be a decent grass type if you don't get anything that's like you know, before it. But I don't know. It's 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 kind of just okay. But I I kind of like it. I'm trying to train more, but my Alakazam will only evolve into like my my Alakazam will evolve into Kajab. What the heck am I saying? <laughs> Oh my gosh. My Kadabra only evolve an Alakazam if I traded with someone. Which, uh, they actually changed that. It's now, uh, level. Rough looks good. Bravery is kind of a nice Pokemon. Basically, it's Pidgeot. If you, if you want to defeat Ice Pokemon, use Fire Attacks. Oh my gosh. Maybe I'll use a Sunflora sometime. I don't know. It's so hard to get sometimes. I'm looking for a Pokemon in this grass that can feed ice types. Twisted Spoon. That's Psychic stuff. My team is ready for battle. What team? The Pokemon are strong. My Ice Storm is very cold. The more you know. It's best if you have, have a Fire... Type Pokemon to keep you warm. No ice storm. I guess we can check this really quick. I think it's just. Yeah, it's this. Yeah, I remember this. Yeah, th th this area is pain. That that cave is pain. So that one, that one's gonna take me probably a whole episode to get through. Anyways. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and end off the uh, video here. If you guys enjoyed. Uh, yeah, decently short one because well, gotta do some editing after this. Uh, gotta make sure you know it's everything. Everything's all good on it, and then uh, my do my second recording uh, of that, which will be tomorrow, um, w which is Anderon, obviously, and uh, see if I can actually complete the chapter because let me just say I haven't completed it. <laughs> Uh, basically, I'm trying to 100% the chapter, and I'm failing miserably, so, yeah. But anyways, uh, hope you guys enjoyed, I'll see you next time, yeah.
Tomorrow, oh gosh, tomorrow, and uh, I don't know what two videos I'm gonna be uploading. Probably could be Andron, could be some Geometry Dash, could be this, could be uh, Europa. I don't know. We'll see. Anyways, I'll see you on the next one.